guys, welcome back to my channel. Hi, say hi Jacob. There's my little man. So welcome back to our channel guys. So today's video is going to be a clean with me video. I didn't plan to film anything today, but our plans to go for a walk in the park got canceled because it decided to rain and I did not know that was going to rain. So I figured I will just take you guys along as we clean this morning. Um, I'm not going to do anything major, just work on my bedroom, my kitchen, and I want to fold his clothing as well as a couple other things. But yes, if you guys are new to my channel, thank you so much for clicking on this video and spending the day with us. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. I truly appreciate it. Hopefully you guys, if you are not already subscribed, hopefully you guys will subscribe to my channel and come back in a couple of days for more videos. All right, let's go ahead and start our day. So I'm going to start off by making the bed first. Now you'll notice that I just toss over my little cover onto the side of the headboard. I would normally put that in the closet, but recently I've been getting really cold at night, so it's more convenient for me to just leave it on the side of the headboard so that I can pick it up or, I mean, grab it when I get cold in the middle of the night instead of having to get out of bed. And of course, my little man, I got to play with him a little bit. I have really got to watch him a lot more when we are on the bed. He rolls so, oh, see, there he goes. He rolls so quickly. Um, and so before when he didn't roll that quickly, I was able to put him on the bed and make the bed with him on it. But now I have to put him more so in the bassinet than leave him on the bed when I am making it because I'm afraid that he's gonna roll off. So I wanted to show you guys a couple of my favorites, just just cause. So I had to reorder this rollerball perfume. I know it's kind of hard to see the design. Um, this is a Tory Burch Love Relentlessly. And my parents got this for me, I believe it was last Christmas. Um, but yeah, I've used it all up. Even though we're not going anywhere, I always put a little bit on and I'm down to like half an inch. So hopefully tomorrow I'll get my new order. And then another thing that I've been trying to find, but I guess they don't carry Milani and Target anymore. Or at least I couldn't find it at the Target that I that I go to. I love their Milani. Let's see. There it is, Milani. I know the camera's backwards, so the words are backwards. But anywho, this is Milani number 13 in Rosewood. You want to see that, baby? Want to hold that? And that's what I'm wearing right now. It's really... Um, very light cover on your lips just gives you like a nice little shine with a little bit of color but yeah just wanted to show you a couple of things that I like to use every day even when I'm not going anywhere I always put a little bit of my perfume on and I try and <laughs> don't eat that and I try and put on a little bit of my lip gloss so I don't look that scary are you gonna chew on that you can't chew on that silly Hello, handsome. Uh oh, you dropped your little bird rag. So I just threw a load of towels into the washer. I have my son in his little bouncer next to me, and I'm gonna go ahead and make some breakfast. So today I'm gonna make an egg, cheese, and ham sandwich. And I wanted to show you guys the wrap that I'm gonna be using. I found these at Walmart. They're called the flat out multi grain wraps and they have flask in them i'm guessing that's healthy i know flax is supposed to be good for you i guess but yeah these are flatbread wraps and i made them yesterday yes mommy made them yesterday so this is everything that i'm going to be using i have my eggs my smoked ham the wraps that i showed you and some mild cheddar cheese shreds i used 
Yes, honey. I used um, the Mexican style cheese yesterday, so I'm gonna try just plain mild today. And my husband, like, these eggs are the funniest things. Like, let me show you. My husband is currently building a house with his dad, and the land owner has um, chickens. And so they let my husband get some eggs for our house. And look at the size difference. This one is massive. And then, whoops, and then look at this whole thing. So that just makes me laugh that how different the sizes are. I don't know why this one is so teeny. It looks like a little toy. But yes, I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking. What are you doing? Hi. Why is why is your passy on the floor? Did you drop it? Yes, you did drop it, you silly boy. Okay, let me pick it up for you. sleepy boy you look like it you've been awake for two hours a little over two hours yes you've been awake for two and a half hours oh no say mama i'm sleepy look at that head of hair <laughs> you want to look at yourself look at yourself in the camera <gasps> say hello see i'm the most handsome boy in the world You are tired. Yes, yeah, you're a sleepy boy. Okay, let's go put you down. So I thought I would show you guys a little bit of Jacob's nursery. This is his little reading area. Rocking chair. This is my favorite part. Sorry, I sound out of breath. I just walked up the stairs carrying this little man, but I just love the way this wall looks. It has his name. But I do want to do a nursery tour and tell you guys about everything that's in here. It's a little messy. But I do want to do a nursery tour at some point once I get everything nicely organized and show you guys. And tell you guys where I got everything. 
So every time Jacob goes down for his nap, he gets his mittens put on, his pacifier, as well as his sound machine, and I always turn on his tranquilo pad, which is located underneath his mattress, and it creates a really nice, soothing vibration to help him stay asleep. Have a good nap, my love. Yes. I love you. Have a good nap. Now that Jacob is up in his room taking his nap, I'm going to go ahead and tidy up the kitchen and then move on into the dining room and do the same. Today I am not watching a cleaning video. Today I'm watching Vivian Tries on YouTube. If you haven't heard of Vivian Tries, you totally need to look her up. She is absolutely hilarious. She does a lot of testing of different products, mostly as seen on TV products. And like I said, she's absolutely hilarious. Today she did a review of a cake maker and she's trying to make a checkered cake and it is just the funniest thing she cracks me up so definitely look up vivian tries you will not regret it Now I am in the dining room and I'm going to go ahead and fold Jacob's clothing and sort them in his little cubbies. I still use the cubbies downstairs even though he is sleeping upstairs. I still haven't fully transitioned all his clothing upstairs. I will be doing that later on this week if not early next week. But yes, I'm going to go ahead and fold his clothes right now. And in a few seconds I want to show you some super cute rompers that I love to dress him in. Now I'm just going to go ahead and put his clothing into their little cubbies and as you can see with his play suits I do like to put them sideways so that I can see what is inside the basket. So I know his basket with his pants and shorts has gotten a little messy but this is going to be, this is only temporary, I'm going to be moving all of his clothing upstairs hopefully this week. This is another one that has gotten completely overstuffed, but I just don't want him to skip, like to miss, how do I say, I don't want him to have clothing wasted, so that's, that's what it is. I don't want him to have clothing wasted, so I have everything down here so that when I change him, I have everything in front of me, so like I said, he can wear everything at least once. But I want to show you guys these cute little rompers that I love him in. Look at that with the little puppy print. I think that is precious. It is the Little Me brand. And then this one is from the same brand. You can tell, whoops, that it's the same. This one has a little little pup on his chest. It is so stinking cute. He looks adorable in these. And then I have one more romper. This one has little uh, safari animals. I just wish that they had a cute butt because they don't. And 
his little pocket, what he's gonna carry in his little pocket. I have no idea, but he has the option. But yes, I love him in rompers. They are just stinking cute. And there is one more thing that I wanted to show you guys with his bibs. So let me go ahead and take you there. So I wanted to show you guys where I store Jacob's bibs and I have a 3M hook inside the cabinet that I keep his formula as well as his bathing products in and I just hook his bibs onto here. Now right now I have two of two bibs. I think the most I've been able to put on is five. Let me see. Okay, one, two. Okay, so that's four right there. So what I want to do is Put another hook higher up to add some more bibs. So I don't know if you guys think this is a good idea. I personally like it. Um, it makes it easy for me to remember where his bibs are. I don't have to go to three different places in the house looking for his things because before I put the bibs up here, I would have to go from here to his um, cubbies where I change his diapers and then we go sit down. So now I just have everything all in one spot. And you can close the door without any problem. It does not bump up and everything is right there. I personally really like it. I think it's like a little space saver and then if I want to as well I can hook on his passy holders as well to keep them all in one area. So I am going to vacuum today, but I did hear on another video that these Swiffer, um, these Swiffer sheets are really good about picking up dog hair and lint that is on the floor, so I wanted to try that out. Now if you have seen my other videos, you know that I have two labs and a chihuahua and my two labs shed like crazy. I'm surprised Ash is not bald. He leaves hair everywhere. So I do want to try to see if this picks up the majority of hair. And I can tell you that it did an okay job. On a scale of 1 to 10, I would give it a 4. I definitely would not be able to rely on this only, so I definitely need a stick to vacuuming.
So the final room as usual is the living room. I'm going to go ahead and tidy up in here and do a little vacuuming. I also decided to vacuum the couch. I haven't done this in a couple of weeks, so there definitely were some crumbs that were hiding in the creases of the couch. Hey guys, so that is it for my video today. I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of my morning routine that I do every single day. Um, we did have plans to go to the park, like I said earlier, but due to the rain that we did not know was coming, we ended up staying home. So right now, Jacob is still taking a nap. He fell asleep around 9.30 and that was about, I want to say an hour, let me check, an hour and a half ago. So hopefully... Oh, I can see my husband texting me. Eee! So hopefully um, he will give me another 30 minutes to do my nails. And I am going to show you them right now. I'm going to use the Sally Hansen Nail Effects. I know that this is a super old brand. So this box is probably three years old. So we will see what happens. Hopefully they still work. But... Um, but yeah, that's all for today's video. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Please subscribe if you are not already subscribed. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. I truly appreciate it. It really means the world to me that you guys watch my videos. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.